We are here with uh, Trinity coach Cameron Hill after the Tigers opening round win in the NCAA tournament, 82 to 74 over Hendricks. Coach, first, your thoughts from this first game tonight? Yeah, I mean, when you think about playing in March, this is the game that you imagine. Um, you know, you have plenty of time to prepare. Drew is a, a ninja when it comes to game planning, and he had a airtight opportunity. I mean, I thought their girls executed everything that they were supposed to do, really did a great job. And his, his adjustment to press us and put some pressure on us to get himself back in the game, I thought was brilliant too. Uh, the good news for us is that all of the things that they were doing over the course of the game, our girls were able to kind of dissect and figure out. And I think it really helped us out for what we hope to be a long run in this tournament. Okay, passing the mic over to uh, Micah Weaver. Micah, team high 31 points tonight and team high seven rebounds. What was working for you out there tonight? Um, the biggest thing was they, they, as Coach said, they had a game plan and they came out and they were covering hard on Allison. They were covering hard on Mo. They came out and they, they were covering a lot of other people. So because they're such an offensive threat, I was able to take advantage of that. And they found, they made sure that I got the ball and um, I was able to just take advantage of the defense kicking off and covering them. Okay, passing the mic over here to Monica Holguin. Or something like that. That's right, that's uh, Monica, right. you've had you ended the game uh, 15 points, five rebounds tonight. I know that going into the second half, you had a big lead at halftime. Hendricks just came back there with a vengeance there at the first of the uh, third quarter. What did your team do to kind of regroup and and get things back? On your side of the yeah play. I mean that was that was crazy um, but you know like coach Cam told us at halftime and we've been we've been doing this all season where teams always kind of kind of get back in the game and, and we've just learned how to how to kind of uh, stay the course and and not let that affect us affect our game and I think we were just able to just come out and and play our game and, and even though they made that run we we came back and we made we made key shots and Micah you know with a huge game and, and other people you know Grace with her assists and everyone just came together as a team and I, I really believe that that's why our team is so special we just you know we, we never we never uh, doubt ourselves and we just we just wanted to win really bad and we it d didn't matter what it took it we just get it got it done okay one more question for coach uh Getting past the first round, what does that mean to you, getting that first step in the tournament? Yeah, I mean, I think for any team, this is the most stressful game. Um, you know, everybody's coming with their A game. They've had time to prepare. Um, you know, moving forward now, you know, the cobwebs are off as far as tournament play. We can really concentrate on this next game that we're getting ready to watch and figure out what we think we can do against either opponent uh, and move into tomorrow with a lot of confidence. I mean, to win in March against anyone isn't easy, especially the way the Division Three tournament shakes out. I mean, you don't really have true 1, 16 seed d games. You just have good competitive teams that are very well coached who have all had successful seasons. So uh, absolutely thrilled to be moving into the second round. Can't wait to see what happens in this second game. All right, thank you.